I was planning to propose to my girlfriend, and instead of a ring I'm getting her a necklace, but when I told her sister she made me regret my choices, and now I might not propose. I, 29 meters, have been with my girlfriend, 28 feet, for 7 years, and I've recently decided that I want to propose to her. When it came time to buy an engagement ring, I had a very difficult time deciding what to get her, mostly because she absolutely hates wearing rings. She has a medical condition that causes her hands to swell and another one that makes her fingers dry and flaky. She downright refuses to wear rings, and I don't want to get her something that will ultimately be useless. I went to a jeweler and explained the situation, and he suggested I buy her a different piece of jewelry instead. I ended up finding the most perfect necklace I could imagine. It's gold, her favorite, and has both of our birthstones on it, entwined. It's absolutely stunning and was about the same as my budget for a ring. I thought this was a perfect solution, and I was excited to propose to my girlfriend with this non-traditional gesture. But when I told her sister my plans, she told me it was tacky and that no woman would ever want to be proposed to with a necklace. She told me I should just buy a ring that she can put on a chain and wear as a necklace, but I don't see the point as I have already bought her a necklace. I was planning on proposing to my girlfriend on vacation next month, but now I'm not so sure. Her sister told me I will be an idiot if I propose with a necklace, but I need outside perspectives. What do you think? Would you say yes if I got down on one knee and showed you a necklace? Relevant comments. Comment 1, that sounds thoughtful and sweet. Let us know how the proposal goes. Comment 2, you know your girlfriend. How will she feel? Personally I think this is a great idea, but her opinion is the one that matters. Response, I thought she would love it but now I'm worried, I want to subtly bring it up but I'm not sure how without tipping her off this close to vacation. In the past she's joked that I should propose with a puppy but I can't do that right now lol. Update 1. I never could have anticipated this post getting so much attention. I really just wanted to know if other women would find the necklace to be acceptable. But all of your advice and encouragement has given me the confidence to propose to my girlfriend. Today. I was going to wait two weeks until we are on vacation, but I don't want to be anxious until then. I would rather use that vacation as an engagement celebration than spend the entire time panicking over how I'm going to ask her. Her mother thinks the necklace is perfect, as do her best friends. I'm really not sure why her sister is so upset. I should have mentioned that her sister is only 19, so she may just have a narrow view of engagements. But today, my girlfriend and I are at her grandparents' cabin for the long weekend, and I'm going to ask her to marry me with a necklace next to her favorite lake, with our dogs. I'm absolutely freaking out, my hands are shaking uncontrollably, and I'm pretending to shower as I write this. I just truly cannot wait any longer, especially after this post. You have all gotten me way too excited. I will update again with her answer. Thank you all so much, and I'm sorry I will not be responding to any comments while I figure this out. Wish me luck. Relevant comments. Her sister is still young and it sounds like you're the only one keeping her medical conditions in mind. Yes rings are the traditional way to propose, but you don't have to have one. I think the necklace idea is adorable. I hope she likes it and good luck. Update 2. Well, she said yes. Here's how it went. We woke up early in the morning with our two dogs, went out for a nice early morning walk in the mist and the cold morning air, and then got back to the cabin where I made us both breakfast, French toast and bacon, her favorite. Afterwards, we went out on a canoe ride to the center of the lake. She could absolutely tell that I was freaking out because she asked me about 15 times if I was okay, lol. When we got to the center of the lake, I was basically silent from total fear when she finally said, Jake, is something going on? So I grabbed her hands and told her that I think she's the most incredible person on the planet and I can't imagine living this life with anyone else. I pulled out the box with the necklace in it and asked her if she would make me the happiest person alive and marry me. She instantly burst into tears and said she absolutely would. She didn't even question the necklace and completely understood my choice, telling me it was the best thing I could have done to ask her. She told me she doesn't want me to spend my money on another ring, nor does she want a silicone one, she says the necklace is perfect. We spent about 10 minutes sobbing and hugging and kissing until I finally brought us back to shore, where she immediately started calling all of our friends and family. Her sister even texted me and told me that she thinks I made the right decision, which feels really great, to be honest. I'm so happy I didn't wait. Part of me wanted to do it this weekend, but I wouldn't have unless I had this push from all of you. Thank you so, so much for your kind words and encouragement. We're hearing all of your comments together now while we laugh and talk about the future. My fiancé, wow, Grace also wants me to let you all know that she appreciated your kind words towards me and the push to propose today, lol. We now have lots to plan.